Hello everyone, welcome and thanks for joining us for the latest news and the latest updates. Wherever you are and where you're tuning in from, we are very grateful. But kindly don't forget to subscribe and turn the notification button for more of these updates. Museven plan to impose sun as MSCDF sparks division in UPDF. Once again, thanks for joining us, but let's take more look into some of these details. The plans of the Commander-in-Chief of All Armed Forces in Uganda, General Oweri Kaguta Museven Tibohaburwa, has triggered fury in the top commanders in the Uganda People's Defense Forces, our sources have established. The position of Chief of Defense Forces formerly occupied by General David Mohos was rendered vacant after General Museven awarded him a mysterious slot in the internal affairs. This, according to political pundits, was the final nail in the coffin of all the old guard bourgeois historicals who had earlier on anticipated the installation of Lieutenant General Mohos Kainerugaba as the overall in charge of the Uganda People's Defense Forces. Kainerugaba, a son to General Museven, is apparently the head of the Elite Special Forces and Command, which is an unconstitutional armed unit protecting his own father. As General Museven warms up for a transition to his son, he faces multiple contestations from his Bush War generation opposed to the Hayrak reign of the Museveni's. This explains why some of the army leaders who have opposed the Muhozi project have all been silently murdered. Uh, this, uh, people like Brigadier Nobo no Mayombo, uh, General Aronda Nyakarima, to mention, but a few have all been eliminated for challenging the project as per the reiterations made by former head of intelligence, General David Tinyemfunza, also known as Sejusa. Rumors also link the attempted assassination of General Katumba Mala to the same Muhozi project as the architects of the family reign, reign fear backlashes from non-Bahima army chiefs. A source knowledgeable with the ongoing transition plans say that several UPDF chiefs have rejected the imposition of Kainerugaba as the CDF, which is the Chief of Defense Forces, with some threatening to even cause mayhem and unrest in protest of the appointment. It is for this reason that the announcement of Muhozi Kainerugaba as the Chief of the Defense Forces has told us Tibuhabura tries to negotiate with the disgruntled mountaineers in the Uganda People Defense Forces. Uh, well, that is it for now. We will keep on updating with more of this. Uh, thanks for watching. But kindly don't forget to subscribe and turn the notification button for more of these updates.